Jangan kepani tante kita beri kawan di sini. Hanya ini ya. Tak tahu ni. Tak tahu ni. Ada sesuatu tapi saya nak buat. Ia kedua kali. Ia kedua kali pas dan saya So we're here with Auntie Crystal, the head of the technological department at Liberty Learning Center. And she has put on this showcase for us today at Liberty Learning Center. Auntie Crystal, what was your inspiration behind putting on this showcase? Giving the children a chance to create their hands-on, handcrafted items. You know, I think it's more personable if you, you're a textile learner, you're able to see, touch, you know, feel the items and have a basic idea and understanding of how they work. Oh, beautiful. So, so we have a really large showcase today. I realize you have more things um, than space to put them. How do you feel about this? I'm extremely excited. I mean, I'm super grateful to the parents that you know put up the extra effort to make sure that we get the children to have the keyboards made with all the, the buttons and the, look, I mean, look at this mode. Yeah, man, I'll be sure to showcase that later on. Oh, wow, look at that. And it actually works, it right? It actually works. 
so right. we, we also have a CPU here that the fan turns on, you know. Um, yeah, yeah, I noticed. I noticed you have. I noticed you have an actual setup here. An actual setup. And it actually looks really, really realistic so as this, if yeah, so it actually what, works. This is what we cover in class, you know. We go over what the computer monitor is, what it does. Notice the student and parent place emphasis on the frame of the computer yes. and the base. Just as it would, and a, a, a real. Just as it would. Uh, I mean, the speaker lights up, but the, unfortunately the batteries are dead. But uh, it actually lights up. Um, this one the student decided and parent decided to integrate numbers it actually turns on and produces sound so you connect so, and go just like a regular yes. bluetooth speaker um, the upper grades did, did the router and the wi-fi boxes yeah i'm seeing where you have your actual network yes as you guys can see this the light that's we beautiful and then we had somebody create a computer an entire network so it showcases how you would if you have an actual computer lab. Once we're connected to one system, then this is how it's Beautiful, beautiful. I see you have some other classes here. Go ahead, we'll just be in the background and take, take in what's happening. In the meantime, I'll just show you some of the items that were prepared by the students and their parents at home. Um, it's a bit windy, so some things are going over. But as you'll see, we have monitors, we have CPUs, we have keyboards speakers everything you would need for an actual computer system at home forgetting the laptop you know back before that we had an actual computer system consisting of the monitor the cpu uh, speakers keyboards mouse everything that you would need for um surfing the internet including the router and the modem they are showcased here today so here we are, we're taking in all that the students and their parents did. So you can see here what we have achieved here at Liberty Learning Center. So let's go over and take in the teacher interacting with her students.
Kasi while you keep on school and all that, you just take it down a little bit because what you're going to give you at this point. And here we have this morning one of the Liberty Learning Center parents here checking out the exhibition. Good morning, mommy. Hi, how are you? What grade do you represent? Come on, man, look at the camera, please. We're at YouTube Live. So, yes. Grade four. Grade four. And what part of the computer did your child make? Do you, can you find it? All right, so how do you, what do you feel about this showcase that we've placed on here at Liberty? As a parent, how do you feel about that? On your part, that is right? Because I'm sure you had a lot of work to do. <laughs> All of it. So you had no help from the child? <laughs> okay, but I'm guessing you're really proud to, to be a part of this. All right, so I'll leave you to perusing. So thank you. A 3d display here of an actual cpu the ins and outs of the cpu so yeah somebody can go from the system put in for me and everything As in login, as in logged into it. Oh, 
Ja, ich bin noch A mouse is an input device that we use to scroll or select. Yes, were you going to say something? A mouse is something that you use to touch what you want to watch. Okay, good. Yes, ma'am. Now, I show you what you want Good job. Where you're bringing 
And we're here again with another parent, Mr. Lee. Good morning, sir. We're live on YouTube. Parent here checking out the exhibition. How are you doing this morning, sir? I'm doing well, sir. I notice you're here checking out the exhibition. Have you seen your child's work? Yes. And what grade are you representing? Grade two. Grade two. So how do you feel as a parent knowing that, well, I'm guessing you did majority of the work, right? How was it, mommy? <laughs> so even though you did majority of the work, how do you feel um, being a part of this showcase and seeing what is happening here? And that is good. And seeing all of this, how do you feel about your school, Liberty Learning Center? Always a friend. That is good to hear. That is good to hear. Well, I'll leave you to the rest of the exhibition. Thank you for your time. Have a good day. Hi. Hi. First, tell me your name. All right, Calicia. What grade are you in? Uh, what grade are you in? Grade one. Grade one. And what did you make? I made a mouse. Did you make it yourself or did you have help from mommy or daddy? I got help from daddy and daddy. Wow. So that is good. So how do you feel? What was the experience like making this mouse? I don't know. You don't know? What, what, tell me about the work that went into it. What did you do? Did you cut out the cardboard or... Did you glue them together? Both. You did both? That's good. And how do you feel having the finished product in your hand? Do you feel proud? Good. All right. All right, go ahead. Hi, what's your name? My name is Zaria Martin. Zaria Martin. Nice to meet you, Zaria. Let's see what you have here. That's your mouse. It has eyes just like you. Nice. Did you make that all by yourself? Mom and dad. All right, how about you tell mom and dad a big thank you? Tell mom and dad a big thank you for all their hard work. Go ahead, tell them. All right, thank you very much. <laughs> Hi, what's your name? Oh, look at that. Everybody is showcasing their mouse. Abriel, this is your mouse, your finished mouse. Did you make this all by yourself? Mommy helped you. Nice. And how do you feel that you, your mom was able to help you and make it so pretty? 
you feel very proud that's beautiful and i'm also proud because that's a really good no very nice mouse all right thank you We're back with Auntie Krista. How do you feel? Oh yes, I can see that. And we have Uncle Kina here, the cheerleader in the background. <laughs> All right. Same for the one that Carissa's mouse pad. <laughs> you made this all by yourself, Carissa? Who helped you? Daddy helped you? That is quite clever. Say it. How about you tell daddy thanks? Tell him thanks, he, he might be watching. <laughs> Alright. to see all the different components here in the CPU 3d model of the ins and outs of the CPU and it's quite it's quite beautiful a monitor here speaker router keyboard we have another speaker here made using the multiplication table incorporating learning and we have the mouse there as well some more mouses and speakers
Get in. Internet 
missing her, huh? No? Okay. That's a good one. So what do we do with the internet? Do we use the internet only to play games? No. Okay, let's play again. True or false? We only use the internet to watch a movie. No. no. True or false? No. Okay. True or false? The CPU is not the brain of the computer. No. Big up to you, Miss Nicole Ferran. We appreciate you. again we, we know that some of the parents had to work tirelessly had to work overnight in ensuring that these um, displays were ready and to the best to the best that they could have been done so just being up the mothers being up the fathers I know some of you were out until late hours of the night ensuring that these were done properly so big shout out to you and to the students who had to do it so they got you involved so thank you all for your participation and cooperation and as you can see the showcase is very good because a lot of students have not gotten um, an experience like this to really in interact with the different components of the computer a lot of them see them but they don't actually know what they are so the interaction is good and this exhibition is definitely hitting those bars and ensuring that these students are being exposed to all there is and all that this world has to offer as it regards technology sure not everything in the technological aspect of the world is here but this is a start and we are definitely definitely uh, putting things in place to ensure that our children are well rounded and fully exposed going out into society. Yeah. 
All right, so one grade two going back, the other one is already here and ready to learn, ready to go. Yes, Miss Shadira. I saw Cavania and I actually interviewed Carissa not too long ago. She showcased her mouse and she even said thank you to daddy. I guess you did not help her this time, so she was bringing up daddy for helping her with her mouse. So thanks to, again to all the parents who made, made it the point of duty to ensure that these things were properly prepared. We're gonna head back to Aunt Crystal and her grade two class right now. Beautiful. All right, so we have Mr. Jelani Lee here about to give a presentation for us. Right. And Jelani, guess what? Dad was just here. He looked at what you did and he said he's very, very proud. So let's showcase this for Dad and tell him a big thank you. So go ahead. What is a keyboard? A keyboard is like a input device with buttons that we use to type on the computer. Automatic keyboard. My keyboard is the automatic keyboard. It is made by Apple. It is used to type on Mac computers or iPads. Part of a keyboard. The main part is the front keyboard. We use this to square Beautiful. I notice you have the model of the keyboard here. How about you show us all those keys that you just um, spoke of? Why not? How about you show it to the camera? So tr turn it this way so we can see. Oh, so the different keys. I heard you made mention of the delete key. Where is that one? Nice. Which other key did you mention? Where is that one? Right here. Nice. Did you mention any other one? What is the return key also called? Enter key. Enter key. Nice. And this is the space bar. And we use that one to do what again? I don't remember. We use it to make spaces between words and Nice. Thank you very much. I learned so much just now from your presentation. Thank you very much, Jelani. Thank you. 
Listen, listen. Are you sure? Are, you're sure it's not in my stomach? My stomach? No, but, but, but isn't it my brain that tells me that I need to eat? Isn't it that the, the, the one that makes that growl sound? Now I know. Thank you guys for telling me. Now I know. Parents, we'll be tuning off at this time. We thank you so much for tuning in, for being a part of this experience with us here at Liberty Learning Center. Once again, we thank each and every parent that participated in ensuring that the assignment was done and that each child or their child had a spectacular piece to present here today. Once again, we thank you very much. Big up to you. And We'll see you next time. Liberty Learning Center signing off.